Hello friends, this is Jess from Knit Plan Jess. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. We are going to be doing a daily plan, no, not a daily plan with me, a dashboard plan with me, my, my weekly catch-all plan with me. So for my new viewers, welcome. I hope you enjoy this and I hope you stick around. And for my returning viewers, welcome back. Thank you guys so much for your continued support. As you see, I do not have Happy Planner stickers today. I have stickers from Jojo Apple Prints. This is part of her Bees and Honey and Lemon collection. I, that's not the exact title. I will have a link in my description box. Definitely check it out. I adore these stickers. Um, I actually made a Bujo monthly spread. Um, I don't think the video is going to be posted by the time that this one's posted. Um, but just look out for on my YouTube channel for that. Um, maybe like once it's posted, I can update this card to link it. So just keep an eye out for an, a link right there. Like I said, it, it won't be posted before this video is posted. So just keep that in mind. But I'm super excited. Um, I was originally going to do a blackout spread. And then I'm going to actually save the blackout for another week. Like I think I'm going to do the blackout the week of the 28th through the 30th. Um, mainly because there's some florals in the fresh botanicals that I really want to use. And I think it would be really pretty against a blackout. So stay tuned for that because I will do that eventually. But let's go ahead and plan for the week of the 21st through the 27th. Um, so, okay, so let me kind of explain how she does her stickers. So number one, um, these all, if I recall correctly, these all came in a bundle. So the bundle came with these adorable washi, washi strips. It came with two things of like little clipboard notes, notepad, and then sticky notes. One is the honey theme, one fits the lemon theme. It came with um, decorative stickers. So this one, this one, and this one. I love it. So this one is all the bees and honey, this one is all the lemon, and this one is a super cute combination. And then it came with this be productive, just like a little functional decorative slash kit. So it just has a couple of little quotes, some bullets, some sticky notes, a square, some little heart bullets, to do honey, and then some different washi strips. So I'm really excited. Like I'm super excited to use this. Um, I don't know how I'm going to use it. I don't think I'm going to use this washi because, because I actually want to do a Bujo Weekly and I'm going to save this for the Bujo Weekly. But I do have this washi because I figured that the black and white would look super cute with this. Um, and maybe I will even pair it with like some yellow and some pink and green. Let's see what I can find. I am a sucker for grid washi and this is what I've got. So number one, we've got yellow. Um, I think that this will be like, this will work perfect with it. And then we have this pink, which I think will pair really nicely. And then um, I don't think I really have a green that will work. That's the only, that's the only bummer. Like I have this green, but that's too teal. We have this green, but this is too grass green. I don't have like, I need a lime green. I don't have a lime green. Um, you know, it's funny because I'm actually, I have an order of washi sitting in my cart for the washi tape shop. I'm gonna look on there and see if I can find like some different kind of grid washi, see if I can find like a neon green. But let's go ahead and take these ones out. What we are going to start with is this page right here. Um, I am also going to use 
the Mojo Jojo plans, check it off. Um, just because I will probably need a checklist of some sort. And I'm wondering also if I could potentially find a yellow, a yellow square because I, I need, I need boxes. Um, I need boxes more than just that. So I'm looking to see which of the colorful boxes could potentially have a yellow. Um, my other thought, I don't think that one. It's funny, there was this brand new colorful box mega book. I did not buy it. And I'm sure that, that that included stickers that I could very easily use. Okay, so this is the yellow that we have and there's really nothing in there. So let's do a really quick flip through because one reason why I'm really hoping to find a good yellow box, perfect, this, this will work well, is um, I've been using this section right here. Let's actually start with the left page. God, I'm so all over the place. So I've been using this section right here kind of for like my functional. Um, for my social media. And that's what I would ultimately like to use it for again. So I'm going to do all those. Let's go ahead and use this. And I'm going to actually do something similar to what I did for my spread this week, where I have the box and then I have checklists. Um, before I go to the Mojo Jojo, I just want to make sure that there's no checklist in this one that I could very easily use, which I don't think so, mainly because I don't want to bring in that gold. I could do this one. Actually, I want like a pink or a green. I want a pink or green. I want to kind of bring in some of those other colors into it. Um, this is not the exact pink, but I think it could work. That's also not the exact green, but I think, like I said, I think actually that, that green is a, is a pretty good, I think that the green will work the best. Let's do that. So we're gonna do this right here. And I'm also gonna take one of the little three ones and I'm actually just gonna like overlap this to make it look like it's just one long seven dot checklist. Because as I mentioned, I'm using this for social media so that what that means is I'm using it to list out my schedule for Instagram and YouTube of what is being posted. So I only need seven dots, one for each day. And now we can go to the stickers because I kind of think that this would be, that this is like cute maybe to go across and tear it right there and then I'm going to put the other one at the bottom hmm because then there's these adorable to do let's do this let's do the pink one because then I want to use the green one right here for, cause these are like my everyday generic to do's, I guess. Um, do we want dots? I kind of want dots or do I want grid? Let's go with the grid. Um, what I'm, what I am going to do is I'm going to take a piece of the grid washi and I'm actually going to put it underneath of this because I want to bring in like a bit of color. 
and then since we're using a green one I'm also going to take some of the pink grid washi and rip this in half I have been really into ripping and using the washi in half just because I, I really like the look that it, it that it gives it all right that's cute okay perfect um next i was thinking okay so i'm trying to decide because of the fact that i mentioned i wanted to use um, these in another spread i'm gonna save this whole page right here because i think between this one and some of the lemons on here i might take a couple of the bees I think that's this is going to give me like a good amount to work with. So actually this little piece of washi is going to go onto the other page cuz I'm going to put Let's put this right here. And then we're going to put a little bee flying out of it just because I think that that's super cute perfect so I've got my functional right here and right here and then what I'm gonna do right here is I'm just gonna kind of add in like a little bit of decoration so I'm curious are you somebody who likes to drink or actually let me kind of back up when I think of lemon and honey together I almost immediately almost immediately think of lemon and honey water and that's like something that I drink a lot um, especially during like the winter and the fall and the spring <laughs> because my allergies kind of hate me um, so yeah so now back to my question um are you a person who likes to drink lemon and honey water i'm just kind of kind of curious all right i'm trying to decide i kind of want like another little lemon here i like this one he says squeeze the day i love it i love it i love it um one thing i noticed these little lemons when I first saw them, because she was sharing them in her Facebook group, I will also link the Facebook group too in my description. She shared a picture of this and I'm like, oh, the lemons have faces. And she's like, no, those are dots. I'm like, it has faces. I can't unsee the face. <laughs> so now whenever I see these, I'm like, yep, it is a lemon face. I love the lemon face. Um, I'm trying to kind of decide how I really want to use down here and I'm not super positive so I might come back to this page but I really like this so far I'm also going to I'm going to hold off on this sticker as well just because like I said I'm not I'm not super sure how I want to use the bottom okay now let's go to right here um where we have, ooh, we're gonna use this washi, but I'm gonna pair this washi with this pink. Um, let's go like this. I absolutely freaking love, love, love the honey washi. I think it is so good. Um, what I really like about the other washi is that it is borderless so you don't have that white border and it makes it look so real it is it's kind of crazy um, if you follow me on Instagram you may have noticed that I posted a um, I posted a reel where I 
used these stickers. Um, that was actually this smaller sheet of stickers that I have for her. I used them for a wellness journaling spread and I think it turned out so cute. It was just, yeah, it is just, I thought it was just adorable. Um, but I really, really love her stickers. Um, I'm going to remove that 2022. I know what year it is. I don't need it. And put that right there. Okay, so now we're just going to kind of put around like these little lemons. And we need a couple bees flying around. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. Adorable. Also, we're going to put this one right here. And I'm going to have like the little bee look like it's flying from that. And actually, I think I'm going to put a bee on this side too. Oh my goodness. I can't, I can't handle the, the cuteness. I just can't. I'm, I'm really struggling with where to put like this little scrap washi. I'm not feeling that. Okay. I, it's, it's going down there. Okay. Got a little lemon right there with his cute little face. It's a very surprised face. That's what it is. All right, one more sticker. Um, I'm literally just putting these little stickers anywhere. We're gonna put it right there. I like finishing the I like finishing the sheets. That makes me happy. Okay, so now at this point, um, I think what I want to do is I want to use one of these little notepads. Um, I'm trying to think of what's going on next week. Let's do a notepad on Monday. Um, we've got we've got tennis on both Thursday and on Wednesday. So I'm actually going to use the sports book and. We're going to put in two of the little tennis rackets. Hold on. Oh, no. Okay. Well, I guess that tennis racket is staying there. I was going to put it off to the side, but that's okay. I was going to put it like, let's put it like that. Yeah, that, that tennis racket has to stay there now. It's, yeah, that's okay. That is okay. And then I want to use one of these little clipboards. This is going to go, actually it's, yeah, let's use the, the pink one. Oh, I have an idea. So I'm going to put this on Sunday and I'm actually going to cut away that little heart. So then that way it looks like that this, if you can see that, it looks like a little decoration on the actual page. Okay. That's cute. Um, I'm still kind of deciding what I want to do down here. So I think what actually, actually I'm going to do, I'm going to use the clipboard and I'm going to use the notepad and I'll just kind of use that for like any additional little notes. Cause again, I want to save some of these. Um, I'm just trying to kind of decide, do I want like anything else? Oh, I know what I want to do. We're going to do a little lemon, but I want one that has the green on it. So let's do this one. I keep going back and forth between like what I want to use. Basically what I'm doing where that ripped up a little bit, it is kind of peeling up. So that way it's not going to be peeling. And 
um, put a flower right there and it'll look like the bees kind of going towards the flower. But yes, I really like that. Okay, so now let's get to the functional part of it. Well, I mean, obviously it's all been functional. So these little honeycomb bullets, OMG. I'm only going to use one, oh, actually, I kind of really want to use this somehow. Um, like I don't want to put it down here for Saturday. We could do this, kind of have it be like a portion of that. Okay, that's cute, I like that. All right, so um, I'm only gonna use one each of these, mainly because of the fact that I want to leave some <laughs> for my Bujo weekly spread. I'm gonna have to buy more sets of these stickers from her, but that's okay. And then Saturday and Sunday. You know what I think actually I'm gonna do? We're gonna do both the honeycomb and we're gonna do a heart. That's cute. And Monday, oh my gosh, I totally skipped Thursday and Friday. I don't show up on my channel using small business stickers a lot and I really, really want to, to show more. So hopefully I will, in fact, to show more of this. Um, and I'm also trying to show more on my Instagram as well. So there we go. I, I think this turned out super cute. I really did. I'm actually going to add in a little bit of washi down here just to kind of um, bring in like a little bit more design. Ooh, we could do like the honey right there. Does that look weird? I think that looks kind of weird. Yeah, okay, that looks weird. No, thank you. But anyways, oh, maybe I could put it like to the paper. Again, make it look like it's a design on the paper. Whoops. And then let me really quickly trim this down. All right, we're gonna leave it just like that. Oh, and I also have this little heart. That I had that I had cut off from the washi. You do not let any stickers go unused. So there we go. I think this turned out. I think it turned out super cute. So I'm going to trim away the sides. There we go. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, let me get these moved back. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that notification bell and don't forget to subscribe. Your support means the absolute world to me. And definitely go check out Jojo. Apple Prince shop. Um, again, linked in my description. Um, you will not be disappointed by her stickers. I especially, especially these cute little lemon and, and honey ones. So thank you guys so much and have a good day. Bye. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and enjoy the next video.